Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Creating a Java to Bedrock Map Converter involves understanding the differences between the two Minecraft editions, particularly how they handle world data. This tutorial will guide you through the process of converting a Minecraft Java edition world to a Bedrock edition world using Java programming. Hashtag 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 Prerequisites one Java Development Kit, JDK Ensure you have JDK installed on your system. 2. Minecraft Java and Bedrock Editions Asterisk have both editions installed for testing. 3. Basic Knowledge of Java Asterisk Familiarity with Java Syntax and File Handling. Hashtag 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 Understanding the Differences Before we start coding, Let's summarize some key differences between Java and Bedrock editions. One world format asterisk Java uses region files, .mca, while Bedrock uses chunk files, .mcc. Two block IDs asterisk some blocks have different IDs or names between editions. Three entities and mechanics asterisk certain entities and mechanics differ in behavior and representation. Hashtag 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 Steps to Create a Converter 1. Read the Java World Data Asterisk Use a library to read Minecraft Java World Data. Libraries like MCA Reader can help extract chunk data from .mca files. 2. Transform the Data Asterisk Convert block IDs and entity formats from Java to Bedrock. Handle any differences in biome data block states, etc. 3. Write the data to bedrock format asterisk. Create a new world directory for bedrock. Write the transformed data into the appropriate format. Hashtag 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 example code. Here's a simplified example of how you might set up a Java to bedrock map converter. This example won't cover all features or edge cases but should give you a starting point. Hashtag 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 1 Setting up dependencies You can use a library like MCA Reader to read Java world data. Make sure to include the necessary dependencies in your project. Hashtag 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 2 Sample code Hashtag 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 Explanation of the code one file handling asterisk the program looks for .mca files in the java world directory. Two chunk conversion asterisk the convert region method is a placeholder where you would implement logic to read and convert chunk data from java format to bedrock format. Three output asterisk converted data is written to the new bedrock world directory. Hashtag 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 additional considerations. Block ID mapping asterisk maintain a mapping of Java block IDs to bedrock block IDs to ensure proper conversion. Entity conversion asterisk handle entities carefully, as they may have different properties in bedrock. Testing asterisk regularly test your converter with various worlds to catch edge cases. Hashtag 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 conclusion. This tutorial provides a basic structure for a Java to Bedrock map converter using Java. The actual implementation will require a deeper understanding of Minecraft's world formats and potentially the use of additional libraries for parsing Minecraft data. As you develop your converter, consider expanding its capabilities based on user feedback and testing.